Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me, and this is another episode from the Beta App Series. My name is Cougar, and uh, we're going to go ahead and try out another another app here today. Uh, I figure we will go ahead and try this, uh, I'm going to try this third one right here, this Autopo Photo. Uh, we'll see what that looks like and everything. Oh, it has a uh, photo editor. Looks like you can make stickers and frame effects. Okay, so uh, something to try out there. It does say teen for teen or T for teens. Smart sticker app driven by an AI bot, Autopon. Okay, photo editor and frames. Subscriptions. Okay, so it will have ads and watermark and save photos. So something we'll have to consider. Maybe something that uh, you have to purchase at a later time let's, uh, let's read a little bit more about it now oh wow there is a lot on this so we of course are not going to read through all of this if you want to read it go ahead and pause the video and uh, uh, it does talk about having lots of little add-ons like the stickers events and birthday and emojis and and whatnot then they've got the little uh Autopo or Autopon guy looks like will help you out with uh, some of your stuff uh, And it is geared for lots of different stuff So no matter what you are looks like if you're a traveler a foodie a cinema lover, you know, etc It's got stuff that you can use so it will uh, work with a lot of a lot of different things um, You got the different effects that you can do and it does look like you can use this offline so if you're not connected to the internet, this will have um, a handful of things, of course, stored on your phone so that you can do it that way. Uh, it is rated, of course, T for teens. There are ads. They are on version 1.7.0. And, wow, okay, well, this one's been out for a little while, I guess, because uh, they do have over 100,000 downloads. Um, now, the nice thing is, is this is a pretty small app. Uh, it is only 5.5 megs, so uh, it won't take up a whole lot of... Uh, room on your phone which is really nice it does have the in-app purchases which uh, looks like it doesn't go up that high it's only two and a half a little over two and a half bucks um of course that does say per item so depending on what the items are and stuff uh, and then of course there is the uh, developers information so let's go ahead and flip back out of here from here we're going to go ahead and uh, open the app and uh, check it out and see what it looks like Okay, so here we are, and uh, this one starts off, and it gives you the um, the ability to select which language you're going to be using. So uh, we'll go ahead with English and see how this loads up. Gives you a basic idea. Camera or gallery. Uh, add them to favorites. Okay. Audubon has the uh, suggestions, so... Based on the stuff you probably pick the most, um, filters and frames, share them. Okay, well, you know, email and uh, and uh, messaging, and then of course uh, it wants access to allow uh, on your phone. So, you know, if you have that set up to do that, then go ahead. Now here you go. Like I said, this uh, does have the ability you can get rid of the ads by. Uh, purchasing so there we go there so I kind of flip through we've got that beauty effects thing um, occasions horror mask oh that's kind of cool looking uh, we've got all oh, the wedding ones heck you could get a couple pictures and create some of your own wedding cards and stuff like that uh, food baby pictures that you can adjust uh, there you go and then of course you can scroll up and it shows a lot of similar things. There's movies and sports. Lots of different categories on here, guys. Lots and lots of them. So, uh, definitely really cool. Uh, pretty, pretty neat. So, uh, clear down to automobiles. Well, let's go ahead up here to the top. We'll go ahead back kind of to the very beginning. Um, and, uh, You've got the cool effects, funny faces. Let's let's click on cool effects. See what it says. And uh, we're going to choose an image. I'll be right back. I'll have uh, I'll go ahead and select an image out of the phone here, and um, 
we'll figure out what we want to try and use. All right, so here we go. Um, got this little picture of Superman on here. I actually had somebody draw this for me uh, because I am some of somewhat of a Superman fan. So they were uh, doing some drawings and stuff, and uh, just just working on their craft. So here we go. Let's see what some of these do. Um, Okay, well, as we go to do some of these, we are going to have some of these things on here. All right, so looks like, okay, so it's going to be in that little square there, maybe. Uh, I wonder if we can increase or decrease the size of that. There, there we go. We can change. Okay, so, all right, so there we go. We've got that. Um, no, we won't do that. Let's try that one. Nope. This one. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that one as well. So there's the what some of these look like. Um, oh, there and there we've got an add on there as one of the one of the selections. Uh, let's see. Oh, well, birds. That would be kind of cool for for Superman, right? That kind of birds in the background and looks like he he's flying through a flock of a flock of birds of course we don't want to cover up his face but uh there we go kind of interesting so you can add that on there um we've got frames so let's go ahead and click that out and let's see what the frame looks like now that's pretty cool adding like the star frame and stuff and looks like you can increase and decrease the opacity, um, showing how how much uh, or how dark it is. And uh, that picture of the girl on there with that on there, that looks pretty cool too. So um, nice way to kind of display it. There's one. That one's pretty good too. So uh, some pretty neat looking uh, looking frames and everything. And uh, Oh, well, there you go. You can make a puzzle out of it. That would be pretty cool, actually. Uh, let's go with some effects. Uh, and we'll, well, here, let's go back to frames, and we'll go no, no frame, and then just do an effect. So they say blue streak. Okay, so now everything has a blue, more of a blue tone to it. How about starlit? That's kind of cool, kind of increasing some of the, the shadow and shading uh, there. And the A vibe, eh, not a whole lot to that one. Let's see, the green moss. Okay, lightens it up a little bit, gives it more of a green cast. And so on and so forth. So, pretty neat, pretty cool. Audipon. Let's see what they do, if they have any suggestions for us. Probably not going to do very well right now, only for the fact that this is brand new. Uh, so it doesn't really look like they have much. And then, of course, if you have uh, favorites. So any of these, if you have an effect that you like, um, for example, I like this star one. So what I would do is sit there and uh, I would hold over it for a while. Is that right? Oh, maybe that's just for the stickers. These are frames. So if there is a sticker that I like, one of these here. Um, and, uh, it's taking just a little bit to load, it looks like. Yep, and another ad. So, uh, there we go there. Um, but we can, uh, if I really like this one, then I would just hold on to it and it would be added to my favorites. So, let's go ahead and go back. Uh, yes, we want to stop editing. And, of course, more ads. So... Uh, that's something to take into consideration. They do do a lot of ads on this. Um, obviously, that's something that helps pay for the app uh, for the free version of it. Uh, but if you want to use this a lot and are getting annoyed by that, you can, of course, uh, pay for this app and get the premium version. Uh, now, there are, of course, lots of other things. Those were cool effects. There's the funny face. There's face, love, party. All these are going to be different little things that uh, are going to be added on to uh, to your pictures. You can, of course, see, like, we've got the flowers. There's the mask one that I thought was pretty cool. Um, 
here we'll try this again and i'll be right back all right so here we go and we uh, are just going to go ahead and use superman again and um there we go so we got superman with a set of sunglasses and of course we can go ahead and change those out if we want uh let's see and then the frames and stuff are the same so so it looks like what those are is basically focusing on all of the uh, the different stickers and stuff like that. Now we do have a search. We can add text here. Here we go. And uh, we'll go ahead and type in Superman. And let's put it in, what color should we select? I don't want to put it in a basic black. Let's do, how about yellow? Because that's got a blue background, bluish background and stuff. Now we can change this so we can do bold. We can do light. Oh, there we go. Great. How about there's great vibes. Oh, that's pretty cool looking. I like that uh, swirly kind of look to it. Uh, it looks handwritten. So we'll click done on that. And oh, look at that looks pretty nice Superman with his sunglasses he's the star of the show I guess uh, but that's pretty nice looking that's a nice a nice script and uh, you know it, the the cool kind of kind of shadow effect that it's giving off and everything pretty neat uh, definitely like that so good way to uh, uh, you know, kind of edit your pictures and stuff, customize them and things like that. So um, seems to work reasonably well. Uh, we, uh, we're we not going to go through all the rest of it. I think I uh, just wanted to give you guys kind of a highlight on what some of this stuff was. Well, my name's Cougar, and this is another episode from the uh, Beta Apps series here on World of Me. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, go down there in the comments below. You know, uh, free your mind. Let me know what kind of thoughts you have on this stuff. And uh, also, when you're on your way down there, don't forget to uh, check out our social media. That'll be in the description below. As well as, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. There will be a little icon floating around. And uh, also, that subscribe button underneath the video. Right next to that uh, button under the video, there is the little bell icon. Click on it. Go ahead and set it up for notifications. That way, you'll know when we got new videos coming out here on World of Me. All right, guys. Well, I'd like to wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye.